Greetings to my church family. Wanted to touch base with you this week and uh, just just to be able to to feel in some way that we're connected together. Um, obviously, it's been a trying week for us as a, a church family, and um, here in a few days, it, it's just going to become harder and more real. And so, um, I just wanted to take this time and, and tell you how grateful I am uh, to have you as my church family. I don't see it as um, just being your pastor, being a, a leader, but um, being able to be one among you and to be a brother and sister in Christ. Uh, you are wonderful people and great support, and um, the truth is you're the only people in the world right now that I want to be with um, outside of my family, and so I, I just thank you for your love and, and support, and um, I know that in this time we're, we'll lean heavily on one another, and um, we know that a family is uh, leaning heavily on us, and that's what church is all about, and that's why we gather, and that's why um, we we go through the ups and downs of life together. We celebrate together, and unfortunately, that means that we also mourn together. So I just wanted to to affirm uh, to you um, that you know we're all feeling the same thing this week. Um, we're shocked. We're still numb to it. Um, we go through times of being angry with God and and at God. We have questions of doubts in our minds. Um, and all of that is common. All of that's natural. You know, if if those didn't come, man, we we would not be human. And that's part of our humanity. Um, but one thing that I've learned um, in my young life is that when the hard situations come, uh, you come to a place where you realize that they show where your faith is. Is that when you have nowhere else to turn, that um, it, who do you run to? And I, I've struggled. I'm still struggling to, to find words for a situation where there's no words to. And um, I know that's my job this week and my task, uh, but it's extremely difficult. I don't want to do it, and, and that's just being transparent with you. Um, but I do know this. Um, in the midst of this, I've never once doubted the presence of God, never once doubted His faithfulness. Um, I, I've certainly questioned His actions, why why he chose not to intervene, and, and I'll never know that answer. Um, but I know his character, and I know his heart, and I know that he is with us. And um, I'm so thankful for that. Um, I've been trying to just ex find ways to express my emotions. I've been so numb this week, probably like many of you, uh, to being able really to feel uh, much of anything yet. And uh, I ran across a song that, that just speaks to that, and I'm going to share at the end of this video. But it it just says, it talks about trusting Him. When uh, He doesn't move the mountains, we're asking Him to move. When He doesn't part the waters, we're asking Him to part. Uh, we will trust. We will trust in You. And so hopefully you find comfort in these words, just as I have. I love you. I can't wait to be with you on Sunday. I need to be with you. Uh, and I hope you feel the same way. Uh, know that you're being prayed for. Your children are being prayed for. Uh, they're being lifted up before the throne room of God. And that we know that His presence will meet with us and carry us through. Uh, I love you guys, and I'm praying for you. Letting go of every single dream I lay each one down at your feet Every moment of my wandering Never changes what you see I've tried to win this war, I confess My hands are weary, I need your rest Mighty warrior, king of the fight No matter what I face, you're by my side when
what tomorrow 